Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is RJ. So today, after seven months, we're dropping back in on Idle Miner. We're going to be checking out how the account has changed and how many coins we've earned. So keep watching. Okay, and welcome to another video. And remember, if this is your first time visiting my channel and you want to learn more about how to earn cryptocurrency for free, about cloud mining sites, crypto investments, and lots of other crypto-related stuff, hit that subscribe button and don't forget to tag that notification bell so you're alerted to all my latest content as it comes online. Okay, so as I said, uh, it's been seven months that, since we last checked out Crypto Idle Miner. And my account has changed quite a lot, so let's go and check it out. Okay, so the great thing with this program uh, or game is it is uh, constantly getting updated. Uh, the guys over at Horror Games, uh, you, they're chucking out updates maybe every month or so. Uh, and uh, which is obviously keeping the game tip top uh, and um, yeah playing really well so when you first come into uh, the game if you haven't played it for a while the great thing is when this is switched off when you're not playing it at all it is actually still mining but on a very low level so even though obviously it's not mining as much as it would do if you were actually playing the game but um, it just basically um, gives you the ability to earn something even when you're you know when it's switched off like it says the last time I was in here was 16 minutes ago and that is what I've earned and then obviously if I want to watch a video I can double that but we're not going to do that so as always with any mobile games they always have uh, things that you can purchase, things that may, will speed up the game for you, so account boosts uh, and stuff like that. But it is not necessary. I've played this game since I very first had it, and I've never bought any in-game updates. If you go into the shopping cart here, so there is always a free chest, and you can, and it will always give you a bit of uh, cash as well. And you do, obviously, the way these games usually make money for the, uh, is, um, let's turn the volume down. Sorry about that, blowing your heads off. Um, but yeah, obviously... You know, a lot of the ways uh, these guys make their money is from you watching videos. But they're not that intrusive. I mean, they're like 10 seconds and that's it. And then you'll get your, you get your free updates. And here you can see we've got seven uh, super cash, which is the in-game currency. You've got a plant, which I'll explain what that's about. Uh, and then you've got upgrades to your miners or your employees because basically the whole point of it is that um, you're building a mining empire and obviously you are the CEO and these are your employees and you have different mining facilities which you build up uh, in in the game you have these various mini games like this this is the uh, rocket or moon game and basically what I always do is I'll hit invest full and i'll try and get up to about two times because that'll give you that basically doubles your profit sometimes you can get over that so look we're at about two now so there you go two two three and then that's going to double your profit and then if you want to watch another video you can sometimes double that again uh, so obviously you can get a double on your double so that's four times profit okay so Obviously, I have been using this for quite some months, so I have achieved, I've basically got all of the current uh, buildings available. And if we just go back in here, so obviously we got the free chest there, and then we can get uh, 10 free money if we watch another video. But yet my coins, uh, the Horror tokens, which are a, a Tron token, so they're uh, 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 sitting on the Tron network, 
they are building literally by hundreds every time a season is done. So for those of you that are not familiar with what Idle Miner is, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a link in the description to a small playlist. Now there's three videos in there of uh, earlier reviews and hints and tips that I give to do with this game. Go and check them out. They're, they're only short little sort of videos about this, but it will give you a lot more information uh, than you're going to see today. Today is just basically an update on how the account has changed and sort of obviously the, the coins uh, that we've earned. Uh, but yeah, like I say, go and check them out. They're going to give you more information, a better idea of how the program works, what you need to be doing to get in your account building and earning a good amount of coins. And if you go right the way through to the end of this video, those links will be there as well. Okay, so just a quick thing though, uh, for those of you that are new uh, and in maybe interested in getting into the game they um horror games have just released a special event so now these special events normally last uh you know four or five days uh and maybe up to a week so if so if we enter the event it because we're starting from scratch it gives you an idea of what you need to be doing so as i said that button at the top where it says double boost no matter at what level, whenever you come in, always make sure that you maximize that. So you can click on that, watch a video, and you end up having to watch before it's maxed out. It end, you end up watching about six videos, but that will give you a double boost for over 24 hours. So even, like I say, after you've finished mining and it starts sort of going on to almost like sleep mode mining, it will still be mining at a higher level than it would be if you hadn't have done that double boost. Okay, so basically, like I say, this is how you will start off for you newbies. This is how you will start off. You will start off with an empty room, except you'll be in a different building. And what you'll do is you just click on where it says new rig. You can see on the left hand side where it says the number one, that's your power supply. So what you do is you click on the power supply and you can see that's ticking down for 30 seconds. And then all you do is tap on the miner. As you can see there, I'm tapping. The energy is building up. Okay, we've got our first trader that's turned up. Uh, that won't happen as quickly when you very first start uh, using this game. You do, you do have to work up to a, uh, a level, a certain point where before you start getting your traders. But obviously, we're in one of the special events. So that's uh, slightly different. So, okay, so the 30 second timer ran out. So I, if you keep tapping the miner, nothing happens. So you have to then press the power supply again. And this, you you obviously, you're not having to do this all the time. Basically, what you'll do is you'll this will build up to a certain point, and then after a while, you'll suddenly get a controller or a rig manager that will basically start take over from your thumb tapping on the miner, and he or she will start be sat at their laptops tapping away, and they will be controlling the mining rig themselves. So you can stop tapping, but you will have to still keep hitting the power supply until you get an infrastructure manager once you get your infrastructure manager he will then take over the control of the power supplies and basically once that happens that is then all start those two things become on auto then obviously you can then purchase yourself more rigs uh, and you, they will then get their own rig manager and stuff like that. And once you start uh, earning enough coins doing this, you will then you can then just basically buy your rigs, buy your rig manager, and it basically then starts almost becoming on full auto. But you do need to um, you do need to just sort of keep building up those levels and stuff like that until you get to the point where it's basically taking care of itself. Once as well, once um, you are earning enough money, you will get over in the top left sort of hand side of the screen, you'll get another manager, which will be your trading manager. And he or she uh, will be the person that controls your traders. So those little guys that are sat at your computer, because 
while it's all manual like now every now and again you have to tap on his head on your trader head and you can see on his computer stuff will t uh, stuff will turn up like that look there you go 42k and that is money in the bank because they're trading for you and you just keep doing this process and like I say and eventually it will get to a point where you will start um, getting your rig managers and stuff like that anyway that's pretty much uh, obviously the very basics of it but if you go and check out those earlier videos you will see how this plays out and you will see that basically obviously it's not just you sat there for, for hours and hours on end uh, tapping on the screen I was hoping that uh, in fact if we pause it okay so as you can see here we on the uh, left hand side by the power supply we have gained our infrastructure manager and you can just see that little outline that's almost like a ghost that is our rig manager and if we just tap on him we can then pay for and then you see that will then suddenly start all those two things are now on auto because you've gained managers but you do need to keep tapping on your your trader and you see here where it says level one you can hit that and you can just click max and that is going to update him straight away there you go so he's at level nine now that is and so obviously that is going to be earning you more cash and can we get a new rig yet no we can't quite get a new rig just yet so if we just keep tapping okay so you see the little ghostly figure there that's now our trading manager so we can tap on him and now we've got a trading manager and now what you can do and for those of you that have maybe not played for very long and stuff like that if you're in if you're in these special events if you tap on each of the the guys what you can do is you can click so we can click one of the higher level trading managers if you have them available so we've assigned him so that means that in this in the event uh, these guys are going to basically work a lot better and therefore boost up your the amount you're earning it'll boost up how uh, sort of how far you get through the special events and stuff like that and how many coins you get at the end of the special event and also as well these guys uh, come with um, other bonuses like you see those lightning discs next to them if you click on them that will sort of boost uh, your trader for what's that six minutes and if we tap on the infrastructure guy that's going to boost his efficiency for six minutes as well uh, these other you've got these other boosts as well that you can see i've already used um, they will come back, uh, the round disc one will come back in 14 minutes and the other one will come back in 42 seconds. And they all have uh, different, they all help different aspects of your mining um, facility at the time. So we can click a new rig there. So we just get a new rig and we can all straight away purchase a new manager. And that's how it goes. That's basically it. You just basically just keep going through the process. Just keep building and building and building. And like I say, the, what I'm showing you here is exactly the same as what you will be doing in the uh, even if you're starting right from the beginning. The only difference will be is like the special uh, the special trader and the special infrastructure manager you won't have yet because you've got to build them up. And when you do progress through the levels you will then end up with if we go into here so these are what known as your cards they're basically like almost like trader cards but they're to do with your um they're to do with your um employees as it were you can see that the rig manager and the traders it shows that there's not many available that's basically because the other ones uh, are being used elsewhere in my other buildings but like I say you can so you can move your if you if I decided I wanted to pick one of these other uh, miners because they're, they're sort of a lot better they come with um, 
better qualities, higher levels, that kind of stuff, which again will boost up my um, mining. So I could just click on the manager guy and I can just pick one of the, say this guy here with the shades on, he's at an epic level. And he will then, if we go back, you see there, he's actually sat there instead of the standard miner. And then we can click on his lightning bolt and that will boost him again. Like I say, for you guys that are going to be starting right from scratch, those things are not going to be available. But for those of you that maybe have only started over the last month or so, or even, you know, maybe have started quite some time ago, but didn't know these things were available, you can, when you go into the special events, and even when you're just you, um, moving around your different buildings, if you have a building that you're specifically trying to get to a higher level, maybe to get to get uh, access to the next building, just shove all of your, you know, your best people in that building, and all that will happen is that in the previous building, they will just go back to sort of bog standard uh, miners, bog standard uh, trading managers, bog standard infrastructure managers. They will all just go back to bog standard. But like I say, the building that you're trying to work on and build up, you can put in all your sort of expert uh, players, as it were, or use your, your cards to get those levels higher a lot faster. Okay, so that's basically how it works. But like I say, do go and check out those earlier videos. If you're new to this game, it will give you a lot more information and more details. Okay, so the other thing that has uh, been added a few months back by Horror Games were these daily quests. Now, if we go in here, uh, you can see for various, basically hitting certain uh, levels uh, or completing certain tasks you can get basically you can get a common chest you can get a reward of 100 coins 200 coins and 300 coins and obviously if you play it relatively often you can hit them daily quests actually quite easily if you spent maybe an hour playing this once every single day you could hit them daily quests quite easily um, and obviously building up your buildings uh, to um, expedite how quickly you get to the next building, you want to be playing relatively um, often to do that. Like I say, when I first started using this game, I really put a lot of time into it. And now I am basically at a point where I don't have to put really any time into it at all. Okay, so as you can see here at the bottom, where, it's, uh, where you've got the little rocket, you can see that I am at level 9. If we click on that, so 7 months ago, so last May, when uh, I did the last video, I had 39,841 horror tokens and I was at level 8. I'm now at level 9 and you can see there I have 101,000 tokens well over that 101,299 blah 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 tokens available and I actually only looked at this last night with the idea of making this video and when I came in here I was in 35th place so if we go into the leaderboard you'll see what that means so and I, I literally spent 20 minutes and I just bait, I went through all of my buildings, maybe 20, half an hour, went through all my uh, buildings, uh, sort of got everything back up and running sort of as it should be. Because uh, the thing is, if you leave your, if you don't use this for quite some time, your miners, those little guys that are sat at the laptop, start falling asleep. So the, the amount you're mining actually starts uh, going down. But so... It is an idea just to drop in every now and again, just to make sure, especially obviously if you're first getting into it and trying to build those buildings and build your mining empire. Anyway, like I said, I spent about half an hour. I came in here, I was 35th place uh, on the leaderboard. I spent about half an hour and I got myself up to 5th place, which as you can see right there will earn me, if I stay in 5th place, 1,003 horror coins. But if we scroll down here and check where what I would have got if I'd left myself in 35th place. So here, 35th place, 
I still would have earned 90, no, 590 coins. Even if I hadn't have done anything, if I had not come in here and I had left myself in 35th place, I still would have earned over 500 horror tokens. And that is basically because I've just got myself at such a level that um, basically that I'm just earning hundreds of coins for not even do, really doing anything at all. But like I say, about once a month, I'll come in here and I'll just go through everything, make sure everything's running OK. You know, I'll participate in one of the... Um, special events like you just saw uh, and then that's it then I, I won't touch it again really for another month and I will still continue to build and continue to earn uh, coins now obviously when you get to a certain level you want to withdraw your coins now if we go into where it says withdraw you can see I have a withdrawal of 1000 horror tokens pending that is the first withdrawal I've done and that is just to test the wallet I'm using because at the moment, even though obviously it is a, a Tron uh, token, only about three wallets actually accept Hora tokens, which is uh, one is, is Tron wallet, the other is Tron link and then the third one I actually can't remember. Uh, oh, it, actually the third one is totally pointless because it used to be Faucet Hub. Uh, and Fossil Hub doesn't exist anymore. So, um, so yeah, so you've got Tron Wallet and Tron Link. Uh, and they both accept horror tokens. Okay. Also, as well, the, you'll see here where it says promo codes. Go and check out um, the Horror Mobile Games Facebook page. They Every month, they will put a promo code on there. And that will allow you to come in and get free coins. And it's not just... 10 or 20 i'm talking about 500 coins in a big lump sum just by putting in a promo code okay so i'm going to leave it there i hope you found it interesting i love this game i think it's great uh, and i think it's a really easy way of earning uh, these um, tron tokens horror tokens um go and check it out and if you are interested in those earlier videos they're probably on your screen right now so get clicking and get watching and if you could smash that like button really supports my channel which then helps me bring more content to you so take care have a great weekend and i will speak to you soon thanks a lot bye